Radio Arcas belongs to an offshore reef complex of the Campeche Bank at the Gulf of Mexico. The area is exposed to marine traffic and crude oil extraction, and the impact of oil platforms in its marine biodiversity is still unknown. The knowledge of Cadio Arca's marine diversity is scarce, especially for basal groups such as hydrozoans. These animals are invertebrates of the Philomnidaria. Their basic life cycle involves the alternation between a benthic polyp and a planktonic medusa stage, both of health and economic interest. The oceanographic campaign carried out at the Cadio Arcas Reef complex in 2016, in collaboration with CEMAR in the General Direction of Oceanography, Hydrography and Meteorology, allowed us to update the taxonomic and distribution records of the fauna of hydroids in the area. Hydroids were collected in April by snorkeling and diving at shallow waters or up to 10 meters deep. Sampling of hydroids was done manually. All samples were preserved in 96% ethanol, except for some hydrocorals, which were identified in situ and photographed underwater. Voucher specimens were deposited in the collection Lourdes Segura of the Faculty of Science Multidisciplinary Teaching and Research Unit in Cizal, Yucatan. Seventy colonies of hydroids were collected and observed, belonging to 36 species, 17 families, and two superorders. The superorder with the highest species richness was Leptotecata, and six new species records were found for the southern area of the Gulf of Mexico. Of the seven substrates analyzed, sponges and corals had the highest number of associated species, 15 on corals and 13 species on sponges, while seagrasses and hydrocorals had only one associated species. The most frequent colonies corresponded to Clice linearis, Dinamena gistica, and Tridentata turbinata, which are species widely distributed in warm waters of the Atlantic Ocean. In order to assess the existing hydrozoan fauna in the area, its biogeographic patterns and ecological role, further surveys should be done in all exposed and submerged reefs near to the outer edges of the Campeche Bank. Also, the application of molecular tools is promising and would contribute to resolve cryptic and endemic species complexes.